how to share an Instagram reel to your stories and customize the background. That's what we're doing in today's tutorial. This is actually a hack my wife came up with. She's a genius. I'm gonna show you two ways you can do this hack. The first is the easy way. We're just gonna use a textured background. In other words, something that doesn't have defining features. You can download the texture that I'm using today from the link in the description. Everything you'll need will be down there. The second way is a more advanced way and we're gonna use a little bit of Photoshop magic. Nothing crazy. I'm gonna walk you through it step by step. Without further ado, let's get into it. So here on Instagram, I have this reel already loaded up and ready to go. It's just a hiking reel that I found. So what I'm gonna do is click on the share button. Next, we wanna add this reel to our story. And then up here, you're gonna see this effects tab. Click on that and scroll until you see this icon. This is gonna allow us to pick a picture that we have saved in our camera roll. So here's my textured background. I'm gonna size this to fill the screen and then cover half of this story. Then I'm gonna click on the reel in the background and that's gonna bring it to the foreground. So we're gonna repeat that step again. Click on the effects tab. It's already opened our camera roll, so click on the textured background, except this time I'm gonna spin it upside down just so it doesn't look exactly like the first one that we imported. I'm gonna make this cover half the screen and then move it to about here where it touches our first background picture. And then click on your reel again. And as you can see, if I size this and move it around the screen, it looks like we have one full picture as the background for this reel. So that's the easiest way to customize the background when you're sharing a video in stories. Let's have a look at the second more advanced method. This is the Photoshop section of this tutorial and it's really simple. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is create a new file. We're gonna make this project 1080 by 1920. So basically 16 by nine, an Instagram story size. Hit create. Then I have this image down here of a mountain that I wanna stretch out to fit this project. So something like that looks good. Hit return. Essentially what we want to do with this picture is cut it in half perfectly, turn it into two pictures. Here's how you do it. At the top of our project window here, I'm gonna grab my guide and drag it down till it clicks in the halfway point of this picture. Then I'm gonna head over to this slice tool. I'm gonna to click on the slice tool, make sure it's this one here that's highlighted. And you're gonna see slices from guides right here. Click on that. And that's made two images out of this one image that we have. So I wanna save this. I'm gonna head up to file, all the way down to export, save for web. If I change this preview to fit in view, you can see that we have two images here. So I'm just gonna make sure my settings are right. It's JPEG, highest quality is 100. I'm gonna save this to our desktop, give it a name, slices, save. Then you can airdrop both of these images to your phone or your iPad, whichever way you are uploading these pictures. So now that we have both of these images saved to our device, let's jump back into the Instagram tutorial. Back here in Reels, I'm gonna use the same reel as I did in the first example. So I'm gonna click on that reel. I'm gonna click on the share button, add reel to our story, hit on the effects tab just like before, scroll down till we see our camera roll icon, click on that. Then I'm gonna import the first picture that we made a slice of. I'm gonna move this to the top of our image and try to get it to be about half ways down. Something like that looks good. Then I'm gonna click on our reel again to bring it to the foreground. Same step again, I'm gonna click on the effects tab, click on the second half of our picture, size it so it fits this part of our screen here. Now if I click on our reel and I move it to the side, I can make our second background picture line up with the first. So something like that looks good. It's not perfect as you can see here, the clouds, they don't match up perfectly, but I think it's forgivable but that's close enough for this example. Click on the reel to bring it to our foreground again. And as you can see, if I make this smaller and move it around the screen, it looks like we have a solid background picture for our Instagram reel shared in stories. At the time of making this video, this is the only way that you can achieve this effect. It might be something that they add in a future update to make it a little easier. But for now, this is the only way, at least that I know of, that you can do this. So if you know any other hacks about how to change the background picture, please let us know in the comments below. You probably help a lot of people out by sharing that knowledge. Again, shout out to my wife who came up with this method. She doesn't have a YouTube channel, but if you guys would like to leave her a little thank you below, just comment thank you, Taryn and Ajour. She'll really appreciate that. Go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe if you're not already if you wanna see more tutorials like this in the future. I'll catch you guys in another video very soon. Peace.